Hello, this is Paul Gabriel with another episode of Ask ZBrush. All right, so the question that was sent to us was how can I export all my subtools into a single file format and still maintain all the subtool names? And this user actually asked specifically about OBJ. So the OBJ is not going to be able to do this. You're not going to be able to export every single subtool into one OBJ and maintain all the individual subtools with their names. You can, of course, merge everything and export into one OBJ, but we want to be able to maintain our subtools with their names. So there is a way to do this, and the best way to do this is with an FBX. So it's really simple. I'm just going to go to my tool palette. I'm going to click on export. I'm now going to select FBX as my file format. And I'm just going to call this Demo Soldier and then click Save. Now it's going to ask you some options. I'm going to go ahead and say the subtools I want are all. So by default, it'll stay selected. I'm going to say all. And I'm going to turn everything else off and just use these settings. I'm going to say OK. ZBrush is now writing my FBX file. It's now done. And now let's take a look at what that FBX did. So I'm going to now come over here to my large icon. I'm just gonna select this poly mesh 3D star. And then I'm gonna click import in the tool palette. Now I'm gonna load that Devil Soldier FBX. I'm gonna double click that. It's gonna ask me again, is there anything else I also want to import? Like cameras and polygrouping. So I'm just gonna turn everything off because all I want right now are the meshes with their subtool names. I'm going to say OK. And now ZBrush is bringing everything in. And as you can see, we now have two files of the Domo Soldier. We have this new one, which was our FBX. And we have the old one. And if I open up my subtool palette, you'll see I've maintained all the subtools with their names in the FBX. So this would be the best way to export in one file format with all your subtools and their names being maintained. Well, thank you for watching and please continue to send your questions to us on Twitter with the hashtag AskZBrush. Again, if you have a question, jump on Twitter and ask your question and make sure to put the hashtag AskZBrush. Thank you so much for watching again and happy ZBrushing.